Hi, my name is Amit Prasad. I am the founder CEO of SatNav Technologies. SatNav owns intellectual property in navigation, telematics, and facilities management. Quick FMS is our software for facilities management that helps organizations manage their infrastructure better. My journey as an entrepreneur started way back in 1992 when I set up my first venture to sell pearls and bidri work antique silverware. It was an e-commerce website that would sell things which were very popular in the Indian market. I also started a company to do shares trading. And uh, my next step in the entrepreneur journey was in 2000 when I set up the GIS services arm for a very leading IT products company. Finally, in 2004, and SatNav Technologies was set up as an IT products company. My 25 plus year journey as an entrepreneur has been very interesting, has taught me a lot, and it has helped me explore many new innovative and pioneering ideas which I have launched into the market. It has also taught me the importance of the first of every month, because as an entrepreneur, you realize that you have to make sure that all your commitments are met and things are closed on time as you enter into a new month. Quick FMS is a facilities management software. It helps organizations improve efficiency and helps them manage their infrastructure better. So on a day-to-day -day basis, it is ensuring that the entire organization runs in a much more smoother manner than it would do without a CFM software like Quick FMS. As an IT products company, we were looking for areas where we could create products that help end customers achieve their objectives. So we had domain experts who were facilities managers and admin managers themselves. They approached us and said that they had this as a pain area. They told us what exactly they would like to see in an ideal software that would come into the market. And they actually sat down with flowcharts, with diagrams, with case studies and issues that they were facing and all those were built into the software and then launched in the market. So that's why we say that Quick FMS is a product built by domain experts, admin specialists and infrastructure specialists and it is being used for them to solve day-to-day -day problems that they face in their daily work. I believe IT product companies are the future. That is the area which has to expand that's the area which has to be automated. A lot of things have to, which are being done manually today, they have to be moved into an automated process, into a streamlined process. And the vision that they have for Quick FMS is that we should help admin teams and infrastructure teams automate what they are doing today and help them focus their energies on better activities while the routine activities are done with software like Quick FMS. As I said, Quick FMS is a software that has been developed by domain experts and it has been developed to solve the problems that they face in their day-to-day -day work. So it's very unique in the sense that not only is it solving real-life day-to-day problems of admin and infrastructure teams, of CXOs who want to better manage their infrastructure, but equally importantly, it's very easy to implement. It requires minimal training and can be deployed in 40 working hours or less. One of the huge value adds of Quick FMS is that it's an end-to-end -end solution for all facilities management requirements. So it's in start off when you walk into an organization, you have a huge building there and that building has to be fed into our property management module. Next comes space. So in that building, how many spaces do you have? Cabins, cubicles, workstations. So once the property parameters of lease details, when is it expiring, what are the maintenance terms, they have been fed into the property module. The space module now gets the area and square feet, what all is there. After that comes the assets. So when you have these assets, these are, they are mapped physically on a uh, layout and then those are fed into the system. Now once property, space and asset have been mapped, that's when you tap into an HR database and pull up the employee's data and then you are able to allocate all these to them and run your organization seamlessly. The maintenance management module, the help desk module, the shared services module and the energy module then come into play and they can help the company use these three initial modules and generate various reports and CXO level information. The big thing is that 
a customer can choose to take one or, or all modules and keep adding on later. That's how these modules are designed. That's how they help the overall organization. And that's why it is an end-to-end -end solution. Sometimes people think that buying an enterprise software is a very long winded cycle. It changes your entire work process, you have to think through it, multiple departments are involved. But you can do a CAFM implementation with minimal disruption to your organization. You can do this by getting various stakeholders on board in the shortest possible time. We have customers who signed up in 30 days or less and they start going for an implementation. There are others who might take longer to navigate internally, but it is possible for you to take a quick decision, get all stakeholders on board, we help you through that process, and you can go for a very early implementation instead of long drawn cycles which are associated with buying enterprise software. Our job starts when we sell the software. It doesn't end there. Because at that point, we have to make sure that all the organization's data is collated. Data collation is the biggest challenge why a lot of implementations fail. And we take pride in saying that we will take up any format of your data that you have and we will modify it to the structure that we need and we will go live with your software. So in that respect, the support that we give to collate the data to help you implement the software and then train your guys in order to be able to use it is a complete cycle of ownership that we have in order to make sure that your implementation is smooth and more importantly, the business goals that you had when you decided to go for a software like this, they are completely met. So the cycle of implementation is our responsibility and we become a part of your extended team in order to make that happen. Enterprise companies sometimes think that once implementation is over, the job is done. That's when you move on, not in quick FMS's case. Our job is say 50% done when we have completed implementation. After that, we work with your team on a month on month basis. We focus on understanding what is their requirement, what are the business goals that they wanted to achieve in the beginning and are they being met on a monthly basis. What are the internal reports that they need to give to CXOs so that they, think they can take the business decisions at their end. And those reports are designed by our team. Those reports are made up and they are sent at the end of every month after evaluating how quick FMS is being implemented in the organization. So the big takeaway there is we are there to ensure that the implementation goes smoothly. The business goals are maintained month on month. We have management review reports or MRRs which are given to CXOs to take decisions and on that basis it then becomes an invaluable work, work support for the things that you need to do in your organization and for the decisions that you need to take on the basis of better and more streamlined infrastructure utilization. All these things, how you use, build a product, how you develop it, how you implement it, and how customers benefit, all these are not possible unless you have a deep thought process which goes into building the right team. So our process starts from the point where we identify an inside sales team who scouts out customers, identifies them, makes sure we are offering value and then goes and pitches to them. If in, in an industry, if we do not offer value and we are trying to sell them a software, the inside sales team would not be doing their job. So that's how we select those guys. Then you have the product development team. The product development team has to have their ears on the ground in the market. They have to keep listening to every feedback that we get and make sure that features which can come up in upcoming releases are done in a very streamlined manner. So our product team on a weekly basis collects all these inputs from the teams which go out into the field, talks to customers, and those points are incorporated into the product and every quarter a fresh release is given with as many points as possible which can be incorporated in order to benefit customers better. Our customer support team and implementation team is also very, very important. They take care of the going live scenario and after that they take care of the leads that they generate on a month on month basis with regard to reports which need to be given, with regards to analysis that has to be done. So overall, between the inside sales, the pre-sales and the sales team, the implementation team and the after service support, which we call as the customer success team, the combined activities of everyone gives an end to end 360 degree support to clients and ensures that the value is given to the customer 
which he envisaged in the beginning when he or she purchased this software. The main challenge with Quick FMS and us developing this software, taking it to the market, is to make sure that it is very, very easy to use. We want people to be able to deploy, make it a part of their day-to-day -day life and not have to spend too much of time in training and managing the software. The other thing is to do it cost effectively. Can we do it remotely? Can we do a remote implementation anywhere in the world? And that's what we have specialized on. We take pride, we are able to do it anywhere across the globe and do it in the shortest possible time and in the most cost effective manner. So that's the challenge that we have overcome and that's what we think will help our customers in years to come. When we released the SaaS version of Quick FMS and we started looking for customers, we were very happy to know that large corporate, people who are leaders in their respective verticals, people who are really pioneers in their space showed an interest to use Quick FMS. So if you look at our clientele list today, now various companies of the Tata Group, various companies of Reliance Anil Ambani Group, many companies who are known players, for example, Aditya Birla Group companies, uh, they've all shown interest to use the software. Top leading banks, most of the top banks in India use Quick FMS today. Internationally also, the Indian branches of global giant ABB, there, there are many others like United Healthcare. These are all organizations whose Indian subsidiaries or local areas, they've been using it. Even beyond India, we've got very good success. We have two large clients in the Middle East. We have a couple of them in the Asia Pacific region and a couple of small wins in the North American continent. So in, the, in a nutshell, customer base is very impressive. We have companies who are really, really uh, large in their areas and they are doing very well once they use our software because their efficiency increases, their infrastructure usage really optimizes to a whole new level. The first milestone was when we launched our enterprise software over a decade ago, getting large corporate to believe in it, implement it and start using it for their day-to-day -day operations was a very important step for us. Next came the SaaS era. You, everything is on the cloud nowadays. We had to port it to the cloud and we had to make it available to customers in that model. That was the next milestone that QuickFMS achieved. And the third and most important has been the recent one where we've identified large companies in India and abroad who are leaders in their own space, pitched to them and had them start using QuickFMS. So getting these large customers on board has been our last milestone. Quick FMS is going to be a major disrupting force in the market. Just like what Salesforce did to the CRM industry, Quick FMS will do to the computer aided facilities management or the CAFM industry. And we will do it in a manner such that it will be cost effective, it will be very easy to use. Tens of thousands of our customers, employees are able to use the software with minimal or no training. And that is what will lead this revolution where it can become a byword or an industry standard for anybody who wants to do a CFM implementation in their organization. There is an old saying, may you live in interesting times. It is sometimes seen as a boon, sometimes it's seen as a curse, but the interesting times is, is what defines most entrepreneurs and so has it defined my journey with Quick FMS. We've seen the market evolve. We've seen it from a phase where people were not even aware that they could use software like this. When they saw the software, they were not sure how it will benefit them. And moving from there to a point where we get inbound calls telling us today that I need this software. This is what I would like to use it for. And I think this is how it will help me. That's the evolution or the interesting change in the market scenario that we've seen over the years. And that's what excites us to do more and more with Quick FMS.